Karnataka, a vibrant state in the southern India, has a rich cultural heritage that encompasses various art forms. Among its artistic treasures are the exquisite paintings that have flourished in the region for centuries. In this video, we dwell into the art style from Karnataka, Chittara Phon paintings. Let's take a closer look at the historical significance, unique features and artistic techniques behind this remarkable artwork. Nestled deep in the villages of Hasunavante, Honnemarado and Miyajina Kano in the Western Ghats are the Devaro tribal huts that spell magic with their age-old Chittara wall paintings. These paintings adore their walls, their colorful imagery, bringing out the vivid beauty of the surrounding tropical forest. Chitara paintings are characterized by their bold use of colors and geometric patterns. Artists employed vivid shades of red, blue, green and yellow, which are derived from the natural sources such as minerals and plant dyes. The patterns often consist of repetitive motifs such as floral designs, birds, animals and geometric shapes. White from a texture of rice paste, red from crushed stone, burnt rice from deepest black, yellow from guruge seeds. It is lyrical creative mosaic that Devaru men and women conjure up. With auspicious geometric motives ranging from yoga asanas poses to tribal figures celebrating life in style and delineation, the Chittara wall paintings and the mural crafts seem to take one back to the Stone Age cave paintings. Today, many young Devaru men and women are proficient Chittara artists and the compelling heart-stopping motives such as Mundage Chittara, Tivage Mani and Chipakal Chinnada still light up the homes of Devaru people. The stylized figures of Chittara painting are generally symbols of bride and grooms, fertility, the sowing of the auspicious paddy, birds, trees, animals, etc. Musicians play auspicious music, bride and grooms affect yogic poses or stand in congenial harmony. The delicacy in its delineation and its repetitiveness somewhat reminiscent of Varli art. It is achieved with fine jute pundi brushes. Drawing is freehand and it is done with the strictest adherence to the tribal format. Lilting music fills the air as Devarus draw and paint. Every situation and chore depicted on the wall has relevant song. This art takes place at weddings and festivals. Bumi Hunume Habba. At the Hunume Bumi festival, women decorate bamboo baskets with this art. The base was prepared by spreading the mixture of red earth, kimmanu, and cow dung onto the basket. Women baskets are painted with intricate designs using natural paints. Over time, both Chittara folk painting has faced challenges in terms of preservation and continuity. However, concerted efforts by art enthusiasts, organizations and the government has been instrumental in reviving and promoting these art forms. Workshops, exhibitions and art festivals have provided platform for the artists to showcase their skills and pass on their knowledge to future generations. The rich artistic heritage of Karnataka is beautifully reflected in Chittara folk painting traditions. This art forms not only celebrate the cultural diversity of the region but also provide a glimpse into the skillful and craftsmanship of the talented artist. By understanding the historical significance, unique features and artistic techniques of these paintings, we can appreciate and preserve the rich artistic legacy of Karnataka for years to come. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe.